Star Wars Rebel Season 1 episode number 10 ladies and gentlemen we are here to next week's episode of rebels man and by god almighty last week's fucking episode was probably the best episode yet of this fucking series man you guys know i've been enjoying rebels a ton but last episode in particular the two-parter not even necessarily the two-parter as a whole you know it did flow well but just last episode in particular episode number nine was a fucking banger man ezra has some insane potential and i'm excited to see where he will be at the end of this series quite frankly i'm excited i'm kind of nerd like again when i went into clone wars i went into clone wars completely blind i didn't know the fate of any characters i didn't know what happened to them after the series because you guys know as far as the star wars universe goes i haven't really been spoiled on anything uh the main thing i was spoiled on was you know darth maul still being alive after uh after um episode one and coming back in clone wars that's like the main thing i was spoiled on other than that i'm pretty much blind in this star wars universe except for what i've seen so for these characters just like with clone wars i don't know their fates at the end do they die do they go into hiding do they disappear you know what i mean anything can happen and i know you guys know what happens to him and i appreciate you guys not spoiling stuff but I, I'm excited to see what happens with Ezra. I'm excited to see where he is at the end of the series. And, you know, Kanan, Kanan needs to teach him about the dark side so that he can know not to tap into it. Obviously, last episode, the Inquisitor was kind of playing on that a little bit. So he's got a lot of learning to do. He's got a lot of, you know, he's got a lot of potential to expand on. And I'm excited to see where that, where, where we go with that, basically, man. I'm excited to hop into this episode, guys. I'm gonna stop wasting time. We're gonna go ahead. We're gonna hop into this episode. Before we do, I do ask if you guys are new to the channel, you do hit that subscribe button, comment down below what you guys want to see next, man. Drop a like on the video for your boy. Full reaction will be up on Patreon as well as early access to the next two episodes. If you guys want to check that out, link in the description down below. But we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna hop into this episode. See what we got. Last episode we ended, I think Ezra was looking at that picture of his family that Sabine had given. I guess our age difference isn't as big of a deal as I was making it seem. Drinking a little different soda this time, boys. Cherry Coke. Cherry, the cherry vanilla Coke, fire. Cherry Coke, pretty good. Hey, Kanan, sorry I'm late. Was that the holocron? When we were on that asteroid, you made a dangerous connection through the force. Now I have to know if you are ready. I am ready. Wait, ready for what? One that could determine if you're meant to be a Jedi or not. Mm. He's gonna, is he gonna tempt him with the dark side, see if he can resist it? You know, last episode he was strong as shit, but I do think he tapped into the dark side a little bit. All that anger and hate he was focusing on. When I was your age, there were around 10,000 Jedi Knights defending the galaxy. Now, we are few. But in those days, we had small outposts, temples spread throughout the stars. Let the Force guide you to one of them. What if mm. I can't find it? That's part of the test. Trust yourself. Trust the force. Tell him the Yoda quote again. Do or do not, there is no try. <laughs> Let him know. I wonder if it's gonna be a Jedi temple we've seen before. And it's right here on Lothal. You sure? I can't give you the coordinates, but I can direct us there. I know I can. Honestly, Ezra and Kanan's facial structure kind of looks similar, almost like they could be brothers. I don't know. If I seen Kanan without facial hair, maybe see how his chin looks, stuff like that. Maybe not. I don't know. Maybe it's just their noses that look similar. You better figure out how we get inside. And don't take too long. Remember, the Empire has access to all the old Jedi records. That's the other scary thing, man. You never know when or where the Empire will show up. I, I love the soundtrack for this show, man. It's just so... Ah, uh, so nostalgic, I guess, would be the best way to put it. The temple, it, it wants to admit me. No, wait, not me. Us. Then together it shall be. Takes both of them to reveal the entrance. I like how we're getting a lot of force, like, information in this show, I feel like. Definitely a lot more force usage in this, I feel, as opposed to Clone Wars already. You know, I know we're not even a full season in, but I feel like we've used the force in this a lot more than Clone Wars already. Clone Wars was more so lightsabers and stuff, and the force would come into play a, a decent amount, but this is just next level, I feel like. Mm, spooky. Quit getting scared, Ezra. Damn it. You lost focus. Well, dead guys are distracting. In here, you'll have to face your worst fears and overcome them. I'm not going with you. What? Oh. Where are you gonna be? 
right here with them masters whose padawans never returned wow i didn't realize those were masters whose padawans never came back i i don't i don't know what i thought they were necessarily to be honest Low threat, low cat, low full front. Pick a path and all is done. Really? <laughs> that's how you're choosing? Wait, what? what? You using the force? That's not Kanan, is it? There's no way that's Kanan. Kanan! This is to be like an I illusion. Choose. Is he dead? Oh, shit. Oh, shit, yep. This is all part of the test, man. Ezra's, one of Ezra's fears is probably losing Kanan now. He's gotten so close to him. Bro, I feel like we've gotten a lot of fucking action in these past few episodes. Like, we really picked up pace, huh? Even though I feel like this has to be an illusion still. Oh my god, dude. That shit kind of OP. It's like General Grievous when he started spinning his arms. Oh, shit. I, it's got to be an illusion, man. 100%. This is all a test for Ezra. Hey! Apparently, someone's not quite ready to become a Jedi. This is fucking intense, man. Yo, the Inquisitor does look kind of scary a little bit. You gotta use that force to break your fall. It's a long ass drop. Shit. Wait, what? Oh my god, more illusions. After all, he's just a little kid. Scared, alone, me? I pity him. Damn, hearing all that shit from people he was getting close to, huh? How long do you think he was listening? Long enough. Yeah, nothing personal, kid. It's totally personal. I'm not back on the ghost. I couldn't be. Well, that's just crazy talk. You're standing here, aren't you? No, I'm back in the temple. <laughs> yep. No, this isn't real. The Inquisitor. He killing them all, huh? Hera, Sabine, Zeb. Yep. Wow. He's losing his new family, man. Everybody. You gotta stand your ground, man. You gotta fight. You gotta face your fears. Shit, dude. That's got to be the worst feeling ever for him. Just free falling like that. That's right. I'm in the temple. I knew it. Yeah, but isn't he on the other side of the door Kanan? now? Kanan, where, where yeah, where Kanan was. No, 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 no. You were on the ghost. That was definitely an illusion. It may have been. But I assure you, I am not. Mm. I'm not afraid. Face your fears, that's what you gotta do. Every time he hasn't killed Ezra, because he can't kill Ezra, because Ezra's the only real thing there. Everything else is an illusion. Yes, sir. Face his fears. I'm proud of you, Ezra. For what lies ahead, ready are you. Why does his voice sound so deep? Come, see more clearly. What you could not see before. Who are you? Yoda. The guide. Is this that's got that's supposed to be Yoda, right? Why the fuck is his voice so deep? Oh my god, man. This is a badass episode, man. Rebels picked the fuck up. Yep, Kanan's still there. Ah, kid's taking too long. Kanan, have some faith. Remember you nothing of your own training. Master Yoda, how can this be? Be not concerned with how. No, I am here because you are here. Mm. I've taken on an apprentice. Apprentice? Mm. And now master of you? Trying to be. I'm not sure of my decision to train Ezra. Not because of him or his abilities. Because he doesn't know if he's ready. Because of me. Because of who I am. This is so cool hearing Yoda talk to him, man. I did not expect this shit. I love the little cameos we get of old characters coming back. Kanan said I was going to be tested, but he never said what for or why. And your master tell you everything, must he? Well, no. Your path, you must decide. Yep. You got to choose which way to go. 
You can't let Kanan come and pick the way for you. Again, trust in yourself, man. I lost my way for a long time, but now I have a chance to change things. Hmm. Last chance. I won't let him lose his way. Not like I did. Hmm. He lost his way. Did he go down like the dark path for a little bit in his time? Tell me, why must you become Jedi? I don't know. I guess because Kanan believes I can. <laughs> ah, Kanan thinks you can. But do you think you can? And you? I'd make the Empire suffer for everything it did. That's hate. That's hate. The dark side. I'll protect everyone. Before I met Kanan, I only ever thought of myself. But Kanan and the rest, they don't think like that. I see how it makes people feel. Feel? Yes. How? Alive. Ahead of you, a difficult path there is, Padawan. Mm, wow. A Jedi. You may yet be. Look at this shit. This reminds me of an avatar when Aang connected with the... When he was going through his avatar state training. He saw all the cosmic energy in the universe and it was him just standing there. Is that a kyber crystal? Is Ezra gonna get his own lightsaber already? I figured at some point he would, but not this soon. different but the same <laughs> i don't believe it what is it it's good right ezra that's a kyber crystal yep can make a saber what's a kyber crystal <laughs> it's a lightsaber crystal getting a lightsaber crystal is a big step massive step now he can train not just in the force but also with in combat he's been working on that thing for weeks what kind of lightsaber could he possibly build with the junk we have laying around? Yo, he's actually building one right now? The years. And I so weeks have passed? That might work. Modulation circuits, an energy gate. Chopper even donated a power cell. <laughs> I gave him some additional tech. He was pretty specific about what he was looking for. Mm. So everybody kind of put in their own little, you know, flair with this lightsaber. It's a, it's a piece of everyone, huh? Wow. Is it looks so different having a handle like that? That's so unique. Well, it's different. Yeah, that's different. Go for it. Oh my god. His saber, man. That's yo, careful where you waving that thing. <laughs> Dude, his lightsaber is probably the most one of the most different ones I've seen. One of the most unique ones I've seen. Holy shit. Star Wars Rebels Season 1, Episode 10 is in the books ladies and gentlemen i believe this one was called the path of the jedi or something along those lines or path of the jedi i did not expect ezra to get his fucking lightsaber this soon i expected him to get one at some point but i didn't think that would be till like to like at least after season one you know i didn't think it would be this soon i feel like this is quick as shit but it's cool to see man his lightsaber is definitely one of the most unique ones we've seen made before i feel like the inquisitors is pretty unique too like as much as i hate the guy his his lightsaber is pretty unique um some of the other ones that were unique ah, i forget their names uh the wookie the wookie youngling who made his out of wood i feel like that one was badass and it was super unique as well but there's been there's some unique ones out there in the universe but ezra's is definitely different i don't think i've ever seen one that's looked like that have a little handle attachment on the side of it i don't even know like thinking about it I don't know what purpose that little handle will even serve unless unless like I was gonna say unless it like doubles as a blaster or something or maybe he wants to upgrade it at some point to double as a blaster that'd be pretty badass you know have it as a, uh, a blaster and then be able to use it as a lightsaber as well but I don't know what purpose that handle would serve if it's literally just a handle because you normally grip the lightsaber like this so having that extra handle like what else would you use that for maybe just to make it easier to carry or something like that i'm not 100 percent sure i ain't hating on it i'm just kind of curious as to why he went that route and it's cool to see you know everybody talking saying how you know they gave ezra a little a, a little help with building you know they gave him a little materials each person kind of put their own you know little touch into it so it probably makes that even more special for him you know chopper zeb hera uh kanan and uh sabine all helping him build it and kind of not helping him build it but helping him with the parts for it i wish we could have seen ezra do it you know because i feel like it's always dope to see uh the lightsabers getting built you know the force just them doing it with the force and then all the parts coming together i feel like it's super cool to see but 
I'm excited to see where we go now. Now that he's got his lightsaber, don't get me wrong, that force training and stuff is super cool to see, but I wanna see what he can do with a lightsaber as well. You know, because now whenever they get into some sticky situations or battles with the Inquisitor, obviously he needs to train up before it, but he'll be able to put in, um, put in some more help as opposed to just using the force. You know, he'll be able to put in some help combat wise. It's gonna be cool to see, man. This show's advancing fast, dude the the last arc ever since the fucking the empire day episode i feel like these last two episodes last three episodes have been fucking insane i'm excited to see what we got next episode guys let me know what you thought about it in the comment section down below like always listen if you guys did enjoy this reaction video make sure to leave a like if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button full reaction will be up on patreon as well as early access to the next two episodes if you guys want to check that out link in the description down below i hope you all have a wonderful day and i'll see you in the next one what is going on everybody i hope you guys all did enjoy that video you just checked out if you did make sure to drop a like and comment down below what is a movie or tv series that you guys would like to see me react to next i want to give a couple quick shout outs to some of my highest tier supporters over on patreon man shout out to the homie that's so gordo the homie silas kane and the homie alexander collins i appreciate your guys's insane support man if you guys want to join the patreon family link is on screen right now as well as in the description down below I hope you guys all have a wonderful day, and I'll see you in the next one.